I mean, it was always a little bit of an experiment to see how many bikes we could give away, and I think I've kind of hit that max. This sweepstakes has been the least, the worst performing sweepstakes I've really ever done, and I cannot afford to have that happen, so this is maybe gonna be the last sweepstakes I ever do, at least where you're buying stuff on my website. Uh, it ends March 31st. That's either tonight when you're watching this on a Saturday night or a Sunday, I don't know when this video is gonna come out, but two people are guaranteed to win these bikes, the KTM and the Beta, they're basically brand new. I haven't really even been able to ride these bikes. How do you get entered to win? You go to my website, dirtbikechannel.com, you grab some gear over there, or you use my affiliate links for Rocky Mountain ATV. They're both in the description. I can't back out of it now, but there's been less than half the number of people that normally enter these giveaways have entered this one. That means I'm gonna lose money on it, and it means that I won't be able to pay for the next one. I cannot afford to lose money on these things, and I am losing money on this one. Um, so it will likely be the last, at least the last time that I, I'm gonna stock products on my website, at least I think. I'm trying to figure out if I could do this ever again. Maybe if we just pushed affiliate links only, because here's, here's the problem. So I'll just be very transparent with you guys, okay? Say like these shirts, uh, I've got a bunch of shirts on my website. It's hard to get these things, it's hard to stock these things, and people are like, well, order more products. So over the years, I've had everything from tie downs to toe straps to like socks and magnetic trays and fender straps. I've had, I've got hundreds of SKUs, guys. And what happens is I get so, like the, the revenue for the business gets so spread so thin, offering all these products that might take two or three sweepstakes to even like sell. And so it's constantly like this process of, are we, do we have enough where we can break even? You gotta sell so many things before you even break even, then there's the cost of the bikes, there's the cost of the insurance, and then there's the shipping, okay? The, pro the price that you guys pay in shipping is not enough to get it to you. If I charge enough in shipping to actually cover my costs with the warehouse costs and the actual shipping costs, you guys won't pay for it. You guys will all abandon cart, and I don't even blame you. So I have, to I have to whittle that down to a point where some of you will actually go through with the order and then I just have to take the, whatever profits we're making off the shirts, the hats, whatever it is, then I'm subsidizing that on top of the, you know, I have to subsidize the shipping and then because you're moving a bunch of money around and there's a bunch of like, quote, income, even though there's super high expense, then the government is at the end of the year, they're like, oh my gosh, look at how much money. The, and then it gets taxed at a higher rate and it's just like, oh my goodness. It's hard. And we did about 40 bikes and uh, I think this might be it. So you might need to pivot a bit. The dirt bike sweepstakes were just one revenue stream. It was an awesome revenue stream because it was essentially me just making my own commercials to be able to fund all this stuff and then I would give you guys the bikes. At this point, I probably can't really do that. I might try one with the Stark, but I don't think I will offer, I, might, I don't think I'm gonna buy anything more for my website. I couldn't get tie downs, I couldn't get things. It's always a problem getting product and all the things. So if I try this again one more time, which it may be with the Stark Varg, which is sitting right over there in June or July, I may just do it, just say, hey, order through my affiliate links with Rocky Mountain ATV and let's see if we can pay for the cost of that bike uh, so I can get rid of that because I don't think it's a bike I would want long term. I don't know. I've only ridden it once. But if I'm only, only going to be able to have one bike uh, going forward because I'm not doing a bunch of reviews or even two bikes, I don't know that I'd want the Stark Varg as, as one of my two bikes. I probably wouldn't. If I'm only going to have two bikes, I think I'd rather have a four stroke and a two stroke and not the electric bike. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, my loss is your gain. Less than half the number of people that normally enter these things are entered in this one. So two people are gonna win. Uh, one person, the grand prize winner is gonna pick between the KTM and the Beta, and then the runner up is gonna take whichever one uh, that is left over. What's going on with these bikes? This does have premium suspension in this video, but it isn't coming with the cone valve and the track shock. It's coming with the stock, uh, the stock suspension for the KTM. Um, and it's mostly in stock form. Uh, really here there's a couple things like a radiator fan and some stuff. The Beta is coming with the SC2 Smart Carb on that thing so it'll run at any altitude. Both bikes are absolutely incredible. Um, I've hardly ridden either one of them at all just because of I've had an injury, had some personal issues and had some other stuff going on and we've had crappy weather in Utah. 
and I just haven't gotten out so to ride these bikes very much. Um, so your loss, I mean, my loss is your game and uh, I will have to pivot going forward um, and adjust these things because it just, it was working for a long time, uh, but now it just isn't working like the way that we've done the sweepstakes. So I'm sad, you can kind of hear it in my voice or whatever. Um, I was trying to think like, what do I do? Do I come on here and I try to like pump myself up and, and like do some like high energy, you know, high emotional energy video or whatever? I'm like, no, I wanna show you guys um, It, it sucks. It sucks that I think I've got to, uh, I can't do this anymore like, like this. Um, it was fun to give dirt bikes away to like 40 people. It was somewhere in there, 38, 40 people. Um, it was awesome. Like we changed a lot of people's lives. And you guys did that. Um, Maybe we'll do one more with that start um, and just see if, uh, if you could pay for a bike and pay for, and like make it worthwhile just through affiliate links. Um, Rocky Mountain ATV has been a fantastic partner. They're absolutely amazing. I love those guys. Um, and maybe if I tried to say, hey, if I just went all in on like the way to win the bike, that pays for it you know obviously there has to be free method of entry the postcard entry but if i just said the way to win the bike is through the affiliate links uh, the the benefit there is there there's very little overhead for me like i don't have to stock the products i don't have to have it in a warehouse i don't have to buy it in advance and pay thousands and thousands of dollars buying hundreds of shirts or whatever or or, or hats and all this all this different kind of stuff so the crappy part is i do still have some products that just came in and i have like 500 hats that will be here any day or in a couple of weeks that I can't even sell right now. Um, and I ordered tie downs like at the beginning of the year and they still aren't here. And so it's like, I don't know, can I get out of that invoice? Can I get out of these things? Um, in, I don't know, I don't know. But I'm, I'm, I'm uh, it sucks because this was a really fun way to kind of help fund the channel and I don't think I can do it anymore. So dude, there has never been a better time to grab a shirt or a hat or any of the other products that I still have in stock. These are the best shirts that I can buy uh, that I have up on the website. Um, and these are the best bikes that you could possibly buy. There's a fuel injected one and a, a carbureted one. And uh, yeah. Money's way too tight to lose as much money as we have on this one. And I don't know if it was just people didn't like the bikes, if we didn't have enough products on the website, whatever it was, um, but, or people are just tired. And a lot of people have like a million shirts. Um, and so if you've done anything to support this throughout the years, man, there are so many of you guys that have been so loyal and so amazing. You know who you are. Um, I appreciate you guys. And none of this is easy. Okay. Go get entered to win these things. The link is down here in the description. It ends March 31st at midnight. That's either tonight when you're watching it or who knows when you watch this, but it's March 31st, 2024 at midnight. Everything closes down for this thing. So get your entries right now. It's 10 X entries um, on, you know, until the end of this thing will 10 times your entries, whether it's with Rocky Mountain ATV or my website. Okay. This is real. This is raw and it kind of sucks. Leave a single track. We, we fall for that. Wake up, we fall again.